And so, London, this is it. Our main event, our final fight of the evening. This professional MMA rules bout will be contested over three five-minute rounds. At stake, the MTK middleweight title. Introducing to you, firstly, fighting out of the red corner. He brings a record of 14 wins with 15 defeats. He's representing Skynet MMA from England. It's Dan, the snowman, Finney. And across the cage, fighting out of the blue corner, he brings a record of 11 wins with 10 defeats and one draw. He's from France, where he's known as Dexter. It's Patrick Valley. A big main event for the title this evening and two men with over 50 fights experience between them, Rob. And as you said, a wonderful contrast of stars between Dan Vinny and Patrick Valet. Yeah, Dan uh, fought literally, uh, I think it was about six, maybe eight weeks ago in Vietnam. He had a, a I believe it was a Thai boxing fight. He competes in jiu-jitsu, he competes in MMA. Very, very active competitor. And across the cage, you've got Patrick Vallee. He's got Jack Mason, Paul Daly, Jake Bostwick as previous opponents. You know, this guy's been in there with the who's who. Well, I was there for the Bostwick fight, and it was one of those fights where everybody said, oh, you should have seen that. It really did live up to the hype. They were absolutely at each other for the three rounds. He is a tough, durable customer and still in incredible shape at 38 years of age. That's right, the Parisian fighter. Still looking in good shape as he closes the distance. Vinny looking to use those elbows. But Vele, beautiful, beautiful switch. Vele now side mount, just... The middleweight title at stake here. And as you said, you said with Dan Vinny, what a finisher with, with his submissions. Yeah, beautiful submission technique. Great grappler. But then Patrick as well also has submissions on his record. Big shot. Then he works that arm bar. Valet well, picks him up, tries to spike him, but the arm is still there. Then he's got the arm bar, he's stretching Valet out. He looks to be on nice and tight. Valet tries to turn. Vinny with the arm, still keeps it locked in. Dan Vinny with the arm locked in tight. Valet not submitting to this. As I said, he's a tough, tough custom, customer, Valet. Dan Vinny keeps turning, keeps twisting, doesn't get it. Valet refusing to tap. Wow. That's what I said, Rob. He is such a durable customer, the Frenchman. And Vinny keeping hold of that arm, still working it, still tries to get it. Rolls with his opponent, stretches the arm out nice and straight. Your hands raised. Vele trying to escape. Vinny just reefing that arm. As you said, the and hand look, was raised. You can see the Valet. hyperextension. Look at that, Mount. Unbelievable you can stuff see here, Rob. What has he got to do to get Patrick to tap? And he there tapped, is. Finally. Wow. It looked like Patrick's arm was going to come off. Rob, Literally. you said that Dan Vinny was a submission specialist. He showed that there. He latched in. I mean, most guys, look at the, what it means to him winning this middleweight title. Most guys would have tapped earlier. That was what Patrick Valet brought to the title, that warrior spirit. And as you said, watching the extension there was quite frightening. But Dan... He knew what he was doing from the moment he hit the deck there, didn't he? He did. I mean, he had that arm and you could see, you know, with credits, Patrick, most people would have tapped a lot sooner, a lot earlier. Dan Vinny, wow. The and Rob, you can see what it means to him. Look, he, he, emotionally, he's so overcome against, as we said, two very experienced campaigners. Excellent names on the record. You look at, as we said, the names you mentioned on Valet's record. There's a man with no fear taking on such heavy hitters as Mason, Bostwick and Daly. But he came up against a different type of competitor tonight. That's right. A very slick, 
very smooth operator in Dan Vinny. Like I said, this guy's an active competitor in, in all forms of combat sport. Did really well, done a great job. Gets that arm, rolls with it, keeps hold of it, keeps it locked in, gets the tap. And he gets the title as well, and you can see how much you meant to him. Valet, as I said, always comes very durable. But this time, he's really met his match in Dan Vinny, who will take this title. And ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for both of these men, please. But ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at two minutes and 29 seconds of the first round. Your winner and the MTK middleweight champion fighting out of the red corner, Dan, the snowman, Finney. And show your appreciation for our runner-up, Patrick Valley. But Tony Colasanto will now present the MTK middleweight title belt to your winner one more time for Dan Finney.